What you're about to see is a breakdown of the Stormtrooper armour which I have for sale, this RS Prop Masters, A New Hope original Stormtrooper costume fully built, ready to wear. Two options, you can buy just the armour for 900 euros, I will go into more detail in the video now, or you can buy it along with the helmet for an extra 250 euros, so that would be a total of 1,150 euros. Two things before I start, don't ask me to sell the helmet separately, that was not, is not going to happen. Don't contact me asking if that's the final price, that is the final price, it is non-negotiable, do not contact me asking for a lower price. This is going to go fast, don't hesitate. Hello there, Richie Stormtrooper here, as you can see I'm here with my Stormtrooper build. For those of you that are familiar with the channel, that are subscribers to the channel, this is the armour that we built in the... Uh, list of tutorials, the playlist of tutorials. For those of you that are here because you've seen the advertisement, because this armour is for sale, yes this armour, this complete armour set is for sale. For those of you that haven't seen the channel before, you can click on this link and you can see exactly how all the parts of this suit of armour were put together, exactly how it was built, full disclosure. I'm just here to give you a breakdown of what's on offer. I'm going to take this the parts off the mannequin, show them the camera to tell you exactly what is available. This is of course an RS Prop Masters ANH, A New Hope Stormtrooper, fully finished, fully built, ready to wear. It's ABS plastic. If you want to buy this as a kit from RS Prop Masters directly, this is going to cost you, including the helmet and all the plastic parts, etc., is going to cost you £849. Now I am selling this for a staggering the armour without the helmet. I'm offering you two options. What isn't included is this neck seal. So if you do pick up this suit of armour, you're going to need your own neck seal. This is not included. The balaclava is not included. The mannequin is not included. What is included is all these parts. I'm going to start off by taking off the arm parts. The arm assemblies then do, of course, consist of biceps and forearms linked together screen accurate assembly just like they were in the films as I say check out the playlist of the tutorials to see exactly how these were built shoulder bells of course with the original strapping complete accurate strapping fully assembled ready to wear we have of course the thermal detonator again the complete perfect accurate size this original imperial this British sizing for tubing the accurate clips just like the original Accurate belt assembly with all the correct plastic parts with back sides of the drop boxes. It's a canvas belt, excellent replica of the original belts. There's also a little bit of extra room in there. This will close round a trooper if it's close at the size, but also if you have a li little bit more weight on you than, than me, this will actually stretch a few, few more inches anyway. Well, not stretch, there's some some extra um, give it, um, some extra material in the, the belt. You don't have to be really, really skinny. You then of, how, of course have the full torso assembly. When it's worn, these parts are all strapped together with, of course, the original strapping system. Once again, check out the videos about the assembly, the tutorials I made about building this. See exactly how it was made, exactly how it was replicated like an original. I will disassemble this for, for shipping, but it's quite easy to put together. It's just a couple of screws here. Things that aren't included then, this belt, you're going to need your, your own belt. In fact, I can throw that in, but you can use any old belt. I will include that. It's just here, as you can see, used to hold up the thighs. You can use any old thing. Probably better if you use a black one, but um, I'm going to throw that into the package anyway. The undersuit, I'm afraid, is not included. This is just a small undersuit. It won't fit most people anyway. It's very small, just to fit this very skinny mannequin that I have. One item you're going to have to source yourself, but they're very easy to find. Any of these items, if you do decide to buy this armour, um, I will certainly help you to find um, good, accurate parts, but basically, all you want to do is sign up at the forum. First Imperial Stormtrooper Detachment. Um, so whitearmour.net and there they'll help you out with lots of for sale threads. 
Also, um, for boots and things, Imperial Boots, I think it's just imperialboots.com. Calf pieces with, of course, original strapping, original cover strip, everything perfectly replicated to original armor, of course, included. Thigh armor assembled right like the originals with this black elastic system. I'm also going to throw in accurate gloves. These came direct from RS Prop Masters. They're not always included in the kit. I've got these direct from them with accurate latex handguards. Perfect replicas of the originals. And as I said, I'm offering two options. That is the full armor kit. You've got everything you need in, in terms of plastic parts and canvas parts, all the strapping, ready to wear, full set of armor without the helmet. The first option is you can buy this off me without the helmet if you so wish. And I am asking you, bear in mind that to buy this as a kit from RS Prop Masters, you're going to pay 750 pounds, I believe. That's something like 800 euros at the moment, 800, 850 euros for this. Just the armor, ready assembled, completely ready to wear, including the strap. Uh, that's excluding the strapping kit, I believe. The strapping kit will, uh, the accurate strapping kit will cost you more. I'm obviously including that, and it's all completely ready, ready to build. I'm asking just 900 euros. That's pretty much just about covering the costs, and certainly not taking anything, any of the labor into account the hours that I put into that again go back and watch the tutorials to see exactly how it was made 900 euros and then whatever it costs to ship it to your part of the world I will ship it anywhere but I will charge the exact cost I'm, I'm probably going to use DHL or a, certainly a, a reliable courier service DHL seems to be the way to go here in Germany I will work out exactly what it is I'll send it anywhere in the world Obviously, if you're not in the European Union, that includes the UK now, of course, then you may have to deal with um, customs. I uh, have nothing to do with customs, but I will send it wherever you want. That's no problem. Uh, payable by PayPal. Contact details are in the description. All the pricing and all how to contact me is in the description of this video, the description box down below. And uh, I will work that out with you, but uh, it's to be paid by PayPal. 900 euros for just the armor ready to make ready made second option you can take the armor and this ready built helmet now the people that know the channel will know this helmet this is what i call my heavy relic i realize that this type of helmet is not necessarily the first choice for everybody it's quite special in that it is a chipper rep replica um, Check out this video that I'm putting up on the screen now that explains exactly how this was made and also shows some of the detail of this helmet. This is not for somebody who wants something pristine. There's a lot of work that's gone into, got into this that makes it look like a worn look and also replicates some of the less professional looking things like paint runs, paint chips. There's all the green plastic showing through. Looks like they did on screen, although it's an, an ABS helmet. Uh, for full disc in terms of full disclosure it was actually damaged slightly once on the inside there was a well it was a crack in the on the cheek you can see here that it, you don't see anything at all it's completely invisibly and robustly repaired there's a little bit of plastic on the inside these elastic straps on the inner side they even have Newey press studs. These are the original, exact original press studs that were on the original helmets. You can't find these for love nor money anymore. These are have been dis discontinued for many, many years. But somebody found some new old stock and helped me make, make these. This features the accurate foam padding inside. Now this has currently got a strip of welders mask material in there because I find that practical if you are especially if you're going to be facing flash photography this is good if you don't want people to see your eyes I will also include the more accurate gel this flimsy material that was used on the original this is like gel green thin plastic or acetate 
gel material which are used for lighting in the film industry I believe in case you want to swap that out so you've got two options there I'm including this because I realize that most people want to buy a full set of armor with a helmet included I don't really want to part with it to be honest but I, I do understand that I have to offer that option if you buy the armor and the helmet together this is going to cost you a total of 900 for the for the armor and I'm going to take just 250 euros for it. if you buy a, a, an assembled helmet from RS Prop Masters this exact model without any paintwork that I mean without any of the extra paintwork the replica paintwork just a plain plastic with the detailing that will cost you 299 pounds and I'm offering this in to, in the package for 250 euros that really doesn't even co cover the costs for this certainly not if including labor and it was a bit of a labor of love I think it's a, a nice warts and all real heavy relic type of replica very accurate uh, so 250 plus the 900 1150 euros for the whole thing plus whatever it costs me to ship it with a courier to your part of the world what I will not do I'm afraid I will not offer just the helmet. The helmet is not available separately. You either take just the armor or you take the armor and the helmet. Not just the helmet, I'm afraid. So to recap then, full RS Prop Masters suit built, ready to wear. This is going to work for anybody who's between five foot seven, so like one meter seventy, and up to I'd say five eleven, even six foot. I've made it. I'm five foot eight. I've made it so that it is a little bit at the moment, a little bit long for me. I've tried to make it as screen accurate as possible. Bear in mind that the actors on the screen they were between five seven and five ten, typically five eleven, and they all just wore suits like, assembled in exactly the same way. This really does work for pretty much everybody, except maybe people who have got a, a lot of weight, a lot of you know problems with weight. If you are normal to even slightly slightly overweight build, you can certainly get in this if you've got a belly. This is one of the more generous. The, the, around the waist, the screen, screen accurate armor is quite forgiving. And as long as you haven't got really massive muscles, I've so only really not advisable for real bodybuilder types. I've tried to make these biceps, assemble these biceps, a kind of happy medium. There are some in the film that are really, really tight, and I've had suits that are really, really tight in the past because I've got weedy arms, but I've made sure that I can really flex my biceps and still allow some movement. So this is going to work for most people with a normal build. So there it is, a full set of RS Prop Masters armor ready to wear. Not included are things like the uh, undersuit boots there is no holster included so you're going to need to get your own holster or just leave it off because some of the uh, stormtroopers in the film didn't even feature holsters obviously if, if you're joining the 501st legion you're going to need a holster the belt is in fact pre-marked there are holes already in there for a holster there was a holster on there but i've taken it off i'm going to need it for another project so it's ready built for a standard holster these are these things are easy to get hold of from the forum as i say doesn't include the package doesn't include a neck seal once again this kind of thing is easy to find I can help you source all this I can help you I'll give you like a follow-up customer service I'll be available on email when you bought this if you need to make any adjustments at all but generally most people don't need to make any adjustments one size really does fit most no undersuit but this whole package either you take the armor for 900 euros I, I don't know why I'm selling it so cheap, but 900 euros plus the cost of shipping or you take the helmet and the armor together for a total of 1,150 euros. So there, those are your options. Be quick. The email is in the description box. Any questions, please feel free to ask. This is going to go quickly. I'm going to package this all in sturdy removal boxes. I'm probably going to have to combine two that reinforce that and get it all um, to the right size. Uh, drop me a line to find out exactly, let me know where you are in the world to find out exactly what the shipping would cost. It's, I'm not going to even guess because uh, I have to look at it with the dimensions when I finish packaging, etc. Let me uh, know if you're interested. Thanks for watching.